that creates conflicts is a perversion instead of is what the rule is supposed to do, namely to help us avoid conflicts. Only private or exclusive property makes it possible that all otherwise unavoidable conflicts can be avoided. A norm that would generate conflict, that creates conflicts, is contrary to the very purpose of a norm or a rule. The state is not only an institution that produces inferior goods, bad goods, low quality goods, um, but it actually produces bads, that is to say, goods that are not really goods at all we call bads. The state is an agency that exercises a territorial monopoly of ultimate decision making. If you can decide who is right and wrong in every case, even in cases involving yourself, then you will provoke and cause conflicts and then, of course, decide these conflicts in your own favor. institution of private property is definitely not just a convention uh, because no alternative to it exists. Uh, only private or exclusive property makes it possible that all otherwise unavoidable conflicts can be avoided and only the principle of property acquisition by acts of original appropriation, that is, of appropriating something that was previously unowned, makes it possible that conflicts can be avoided from the beginning of mankind on, so to speak, until its very, uh, very end. Because the first appropriator of something did not involve anyone in any conflict. He was the first one. Nobody else was there. So the first appropriation of something as private property is a conflict-free way of transferring something that was previously some external thing into something that is private property.